सदाशिवसरंभा शंकराचार्यमध्यमा अस्मदाचार्यपर्यता वंदे गुरुपरंपरा I welcome you all with my love and respects. Today's morning sutra: less thoughts, more action. Hurry up to slow down. less thoughts less action is tamas inertness more thoughts more action is rajas restlessness less thoughts more action is sattva living enlightenment please understand i am equating sattva into jivan mukti the restful awareness as living enlightenment because restful en- awareness is a direct way to living enlightenment let me define restful awareness when you walk just feel through your body who is perceiving the earth who is seeing the scenes just see with awareness feel with awareness the cold feel with awareness how you respond to this morning feel with awareness how you are responding to your own old boring or worrying thoughts such beautiful morning but suddenly some thought about something some days before happened may happen after that one thought enough to take away the whole beauty of this morning perceive with awareness the awareness which perceives is only you nothing else the moment you bring awareness two things will happen one the slowing down second is an important thing please understand one slowing down second immediate shift in your consciousness immediate shift in your consciousness what i call as cognitive shift the space where cognition happens in you the gear gets shifted from matter to consciousness actually unclutching is necessary for this shift only for any gear change you need disclutching of gear plate and engine gear box and engine same way for the shift cognitive shift from the matter to energy 
consciousness you need that unclutching I tell you infusing awareness into you will automatically make unclutching happen and the shift in the cognition how you perceive will happen immediately just live for few days you will realize with less thought more actions are happening in you physically mentally in all possible ways be aware while you walk perceive through your eyes perceive through all other senses remember just perceiving is different knowing that you are perceiving is different just taking bath is different knowing you are taking bath is different just walking is different being aware that you are walking is different just talking is different being aware you are talking is different infuse awareness into everything walking talking sitting living breathing shiva says in shiva sutras one sneezing with awareness is enough for enlightenment because during sneezing your whole nervous system gets activated one sneezing with clear awareness awareness that you are sneezing that face muscles are shrinking and all the things are happening an explosion you are enlightened all you need is one sneezing with awareness that's all when you infuse awareness this is no more one more day this is no more one more morning this is the morning this is the day i don't know in how many dimensions you will be awakened exactly what i mean by the word inner awakening is infusing awareness into you that's all in malaysia on satsang on devotee put a question swami ji give the essence of your message in malaysian language at least one word that oh god just two days before i landed in malaysia and this guy is asking a sense of my message and that also in malaysian language but fortunately that day only something happened very strange incident when we were driving in the car the sideboard all the sign boards are there 
So, the person who was driving me, I asked him, what is the meaning of that word, which is again and again recurring? He said, Swamiji, slow down. <laughs> so, I picked up that word and I said, this is my message, Kurankan Laju. <laughs> that is a Malaysian word. <laughs> Malaysian word for slow down. <laughs> So, I tell you in any language essence of my message is this one word slow down, hurry up to slow down, otherwise you will be wasting your time without slowing down. If you want to reach the place late hurry up, if you want to reach the place early slow down. The essence of life is slowing down. Even now I can very clearly feel there is nobody in this body except just a kind of a line of a simple kind of a when you put a mirror when the sun reflects on the mirror how it, it is seen in the air kind of reflection. See if you put a mirror, the sun reflects in the mirror and it falls on a wall. Between the wall and the mirror, in the air some different color will be seen, that reflection flowing. How thin and indescribable the flow of that reflection, exactly same way I am feeling something is moving around the area of this body which is perceiving everything that is me. I am describing exactly visually as I am feeling. When you start perceiving through all the instruments with which you can perceive including mind you will exactly feel the same thing, empty, oh God. Then all my worries, fears, insecurities, greed, no base, no base, that is the truth, that is the truth. Infuse awareness again and again and again you will see less thoughts, more action happens immediately. The moment less thoughts have started happening, body and mind will be in different space. Zen living is what I call less thoughts, more actions. Zen living will immediately create yogic body and Vedic mind. If you have scratched your head without consciousness, stop, do it again consciously, see how it feels. Try now, consciously move. Feel the chillness, see the green, feel the raindrops on the system with which you are perceiving. Smell the smell of the land which raises due to rain. Taste the how the tongue feels when you see the green and smell the land and feel the rain. Perceive how your mind is reacting 
to this whole scene? Is it interested in perceiving or is it interested in worrying about something about the past or the future without being bothered about this perception? That is the sixth sense. It is called balance. Five senses and whatever cannot be classified as that five is balance, sixth sense. Like a legal terms, all the rules after they, they put, they say whatever is untold, undescribable, unsaid. Same way, five senses, major perceptions, and sixth, whatever can't be described, balance. Just see all these six, how you perceive through all these six, how all these six are perceived. Less thoughts, more action. Less words, more awareness. So hurry up to slow down. Let you all live and radiate enlightenment. Live and radiate the eternal bliss. Nityananda. Thank you.